Hey folks, um, well, it's still raining and we definitely need it in our area. Uh, so I'm still thankful to the Lord. Uh, for those of you who are having hard times with mudslides and stuff, and we may be getting a lot of rain, um, a little, little too fast, but I'm still grateful for the rain and grateful for the Lord helping me, you know, with that. And, uh, at least in our state. So for all those who are having uh, bad weather. Um, I wish for you, you know, safety and and stay warm. So I've been working on my song. As you can see, I have my guitar here. Um, but before I do that, I just want to give you a little uh, update with news that we're not getting on our news, uh, which is there's been some sort of a nuclear accident attack. I don't know in the Ukraine. Uh, a a thousand mega ton reactor um, some sort of accident you know we thought Fukushima was bad um, in Japan uh, I you know don't don't know what's going on if this was by the Russians or this is something that happened at their plant uh, I do know that they've been ha been attacked by EMT attacks and that's definitely probably by Russia big old you know um, uh, reaction going on in the sky just co complete blinding light uh, that takes out the power grid okay and so that's that's an attack and uh, there's a there's attacks of all kinds that we've been getting so anyway prayers for 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 the world again okay uh, this is this is what's going on this is the evil side of what's happening in our world um, so, you know, definitely be praying uh, again. And um, so anyway, so I thought I'd just do the song really quick uh, before I head out. And um, I've, I've been trying to, uh, hopefully I can play it better this time. This is George Harrison's Here Comes the Sun. I have it on the second fret capoed. Uh, and uh, it gives me more room. But if you want the, the sound from the record or the CD, you want to put the capo on the seventh fret and play the same chords, okay? And so, anyway, so here it goes. still working on it okay I'm still working on it um, I did uh, found another little cool thing when you're you know playing the blues sort of a a, a, a a turnaround if you will and I'm starting this one on the fifth fret um, it's kind of cool so like if you're playing you know Do 
Uh, I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> I'm still learning, still playing, still trying to figure things out. And um, anyway, so listen, time's getting short. You need to make a decision. Accept the Lord into your life because you don't want to be here in the tribulation time. Okay? We who are Christians are not meant for God's wrath or the wrath of the Lord. And I really am a pre-tribber, if you will, believer. I believe that he will snatch us up before it gets even worse. And we know that these days are going to be shortened for that reason. A lot of things are happening really fast in the world. And if you look at Israel, all the trembling going on over there at the Temple Mound, uh, they're being surrounded by uh, Iran, Saudi Arabia, Turkey, Egypt, um, <clears throat> Jordan. Uh, we know that Damascus will be destroyed in one day, if you read the Bible. And um, Egypt is, uh, you know, uh, op opening up its its borders, um, trying to, you know, push back the the Palestinians. But they're they're all they're all surrounding, you know, Israel, and that's where the focus is right now. And the world, a new world order is there, and that's what their focus is on, because we know that. Eventually, the Antichrist will try, take over the temple when the temple is built, and we look forward to that temple being built. Um, and we know that he will be called the Assyrian, or you know, he may be coming out of Turkey. Uh, we also know that um, that Russia will be involved, and then who's who's in Turkey? <laughs> out of the blue, Putin is there. You know, so it's not like. We don't know what's going on. We, we are told that we will be given signs. We'll see signs in the heavens like the blood moons on the earth, the earthquakes in diverse places, um, all kinds of signs. If you, if you saw any signs over in, uh, in Michigan, all these weird things coming down from the sky, fiery balls and stuff. I mean, just absolute weird stuff. I mean, even in China, so some poor lady... Or two people were in their car and they were driving and a sinkhole just opens up, you know. And they were able just to get out just in time before the car, you know, goes into the sinkhole upside down. So, there, I mean, there's just all, I mean, that kind of stuff would have been, you know, 10 years ago. Uh, especially this Ukraine thing, this would have been front page news. Now all we're getting is this, you know... <sighs> repeated news after news after news on on the same situation that you know shouldn't have happened in the first place and or you know stuff that just this doesn't have anything really to do with with uh, our soul and 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 what's happening spiritually in the world we're just getting all this crap on the television that doesn't you know doesn't say anything about what's really really going on and we know that the New World Order, the Beast, whatever, is taking over. And, and they're being blatant about it. They're being open about it. They're just, they don't care now. Because they're, they're working on their agenda. And uh, they think they've got everything in, in place. But God, ultimately, is in charge. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Right? And, um, you know, hey, folks, I read the end of the book. Guess what? We win. <laughs> you know, hate hate to burst your bubble, but so you, it's time for you to make a decision. Accept the Lord into your heart. Have Him show you His way. Have the Holy Spirit help you to understand what it is that He wants you to do. What you were meant for. Why you're here on this earth. Our purpose is to serve Him, not ourselves. Not to get all in, you know, enmeshed in our own little lives and our own little family. Although that, you know, yes, that, that keeps us going day to day. But that's not the whole purpose, okay? The purpose is to be serving Him. So, anyway, make a decision. I hope that this is a blessing to some of you. I feel like it was. And hopefully I can upload this. <laughs> Have a great day. All right. Love you guys. Bye-bye.